Persuadable. Everybody's like, oh my god, persuadable, you're always so happy. Nah, not all the time. Instead of a swear jar, I have a negativity jar. Every time I have a pessimistic thought, I put a dollar into it. It's currently half empty. <laughs> That's so bad, I love it. How we all doing? Here's another episode of Destroying Hunters and absolutely wiggle on my chicken nugget everywhere. So hard, even Chick-fil-A is upset. Except for this chicken nugget, it's open seven days a week. All right, so a lot of things that you guys have probably already seen. Just showing you guys a lot of consistency. Showing you all how to wiggle your chicken nugget like a mess. You know, I thought about this last night. I was like, what if I, you know, what happens if I die young? You know, what, what happens if I die tomorrow? In the back of my head, I was like, I'm probably only going to be known for two things. Pup, 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 persuadable, and I'm going to wiggle my chicken nugget. And it made me think about my life, and I'm like, but can you imagine that if you die, and the only thing you're remembered for is I'm going to wiggle my chicken nugget? I'm like, I, got, I need to survive. I need to survive. If, 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 if that's the only thing I'm remembered for, I got a lot of things that I got to do in this world. That means that I need to learn how to kite these hunters like professionals. Ladies and gentlemen, I am too young. My skin, actually, my skin's kind of getting a little wrinkly. I'm getting a little old, but it's whatever. We run with it. We, we're cool with it. And on top of that, I just want to let you all know one thing. I'm not done cutting. We got a long lot of footage to look at, so let's do this. Man, after this video, it's a lot of these hunters, it's so funny when hunters get too... You know what they need to do? Do you know what they need to do? They need to make a map where it's just the ocean. That's what they need to do, where we're just swimming around obstacles instead of running. You're probably like, oh my God, Persuable, why do they need to come out with an ocean map? So when we make Hunter salty, it just makes it more fitting. <laughs> Man, I got this ripper mad. Look at him, he's tuttling me. He's tuttling me. I'm gonna get in trouble for this joke, but I'm gonna say it anyways. He's more angry than Gordon Ramsay eating a stripper's booty hole. <laughs> I assume that the Ripper likes corn because this dude is stalking me. Oh, boom! Roasted. Oh my God, Persuadable. That joke was so corny. Ho, 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 ho. That was really punny. All right, both of you calm down. It was the best that I could come up with. And why am I talking to myself in three voices? Damn it. You listen here, son. You better not talk to me like that. Yeah, you don't talk to us like that. Whoa, ho, ho, ho. Both of you double teaming me. I feel like Lisa Ann and Nailin' Balin. Okay, never mind. <laughs> so much trouble for that all right we gotta oh i'm way too energized today this is bad Whew. okay god i feel like kim kardashian in her first now nah, okay stop it we're just gonna move on so i thought i was like getting like really far away from this dude and then he throws his rihanna's umbrella and it really made me upset so i was like all right it's my turn to now kite you because honestly i don't know how people lose to wu chang i just don't think he is good early game i just don't consider him a good hunter Early game. It, I'm just, it's as good as Paris Hilton's acting career in the House of Wax. It's just horrible. All right, so I'm going to show you how you kite a Wu Chang. And you know, you know what upsets me about this kite is that the kite, like this clip is about three minutes long, right? And we still end up losing the match. It's just so low Q for you. <laughs> Before I keep going into the commentary of the match, um, I would really like to let you guys know about a joke that I just said in Discord. And none of them laughed. So I'm going to say it now because I have nothing to lose. What do you call a man with no shin? Tony. <laughs> It'll be like, what does that mean? You'll get it, toe, and then knee, and you got no shin, so you toe knee. How is that not funny? Listen, guys, you have to have a bad sense of humor in this world. You will become a better friend and a better lover. And what you need to do is, it is my honest philosophy that if people laugh at dad jokes, those are the best people to get close to in your life because those are the people who just look at the absurdity of something, they don't dissect it, and they just chill. They laugh to it because it's stupid. 
Oh, hey, here's another joke. Did you hear about Velcro being a ripoff? <laughs> it's so dumb. It's not funny. You know what else is not funny? There's Wu Chang absolutely being humiliated. So what I did back there, right, was I uh, body blocked for the doctor. <laughs> it's like I got to catch up and let you all know what I did. So I body blocked for the doctor because I didn't want the doctor going down. The doctor was able to get away, and now I'm doing my thing. Yeah, this Wu Chang loves me. This Wu Chang loves me. It will not leave me whatsoever. You know why? It's because Wu Chang knows that I'm a dancer, knows that I'm flexible, and I can be doing those freaky moves during nay nay time. Probably think that he could swing from a ceiling fan like Tarzan. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know why he's coming after me. You are. They always like the flexible ones. They always like the flexible ones. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'm running out of jokes, Wu Chang. Can we finish this up, please? <laughs> Can we get to the next clip? <laughs> Woo! Got away from that one. That was fun. Celebration time, baby! All right, we're going to get back into the gameplay real quick. So watch this. Watch how bad I mess up, and then I recover. So look at the coordinator, right? Coordinator is hit. Coordinator is going to go down. Coordinator did a very good rescue. Coordinator goes down. For some reason, I think the geisha is still near the coordinator. So I'm just decoding. Coordinator get, I, I, sorry, Geisha gets an easy hit on me. Easy hit. And I, <laughs> now this is legendary rank mode. So this is a top Geisha player. And I'm, I get super nervous. I'm like, yo, I gave up an easy hit. Now she's trying to use that crack like a plumber to, to try to get to me. And I know that she's trying to get to me using that crack in the wall right there to the left, right? She's trying to look at me through the crack. And I'm not going to allow it to happen. And that's why I'm doing this. She's going to, she's going to, now she's going to get fed up with the crack. She's going to try to charge me normal. And then I'm going to run back to the wall. Yep. There we go. Gotcha. Ha ha. And then, thank God. Woo. 60 second kite as a one shot. Man, that, that first hit though. That first hit was amazing. All right. Here comes the teleport. And uh, <laughs> I forgot my train of thought. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I, <laughs> you know, I'm not gonna. I'm not going to edit this video. I'm just gonna keep it here. I'm just gonna keep it here, and I'm just gonna keep myself embarrassed. <laughs> um, you know what? I actually don't know if this is copy footage. So I'm coming out with the destroying hunters and the persuadable effect. And because I've been really disorganized lately, I'm starting to wonder if some of this stuff is repeat. So if it is, I apologize. I can't remember what footage I've used and what footage I haven't used. Uh, I'm trying to get these two videos done so I can delete all my footage so I can restart and then I can be a little bit more organized. So, But anyways, whatever. Uh, we, can, we can keep cutting and then he ends up leaving me. And then the next footage that I'm going to show is the beginning of a legendary match. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you what really happens there. And uh, yeah, here we go. So this is the pre-lobby. So often, oftentimes I cut this stuff out. But I decided not to this time because I want to show you that I try to ban the Ripper every time. As a dancer user, the Ripper is your biggest enemy. Uh, I feel like Spider is kind of a joke uh, against the dancer. I think the dancer, oh, that's me being reconnected because of my wonderful ping. <laughs> and there's been a little bit of an influx of new players, surprisingly. So... I want you guys to see what it's like to get to uh, tier five and tier six when you get into the uh, the top tier competitive gameplay where you can ban a hunter and they can ban a hunter. And this is just me uh, talking to the team because I know that the Ripper has been banned, I believe. I'm letting them know I'll do the second rescue. Now, if you go against the Ripper, I don't like to do the rescuing. I'd prefer a Seer or a Perfumer. Uh, because they can absorb the attacks, right? So because it is somebody other than the Ripper, I can do the uh, the second rescue relatively easily. So you guys are going to see what it's like, how I actually play from start to finish. I could do this with any film at any point in time. I just decided to include it in this footage today. I'll probably have more, you know, full game footages soon. So there's no cutting or editing of the video gameplay. And I know that usually in this area, this is where hunters like to go. They don't necessarily like to go right here, 
but they like to go to the uh, small hut. And so I actually take a little bit of a gamble here. I do take a little bit of a gamble. And because I know that I'm going to be in this area for probably a while, I decide to just throw down the blue box. That's not necessarily a good strategy. I'm not saying it's a good strategy, but I, I get the heartbeat. And instead of running to the blue area, he's going to take his time really taking down that first box. And he thinks that he's doing a good thing, but really what he's doing is he bought me uh, an extra like 10 seconds taking down that box. So we're going to run back to this area. I'm not really going to throw the box down because I don't have enough time, right? I know that he's got the spider web over there, and I'm going to probably put another box down now. So when he tries to come over here, whether he goes through the window, I'm waiting for his move. And now, now I know he's probably taking the other box down, so I'm going to use this timing to kind of reposition myself. Now, if he didn't take the box down, it doesn't matter because I would have used that to my advantage as well. And there you go. He teleports away. That, that's a spider that just gave up on you early game. And that's, that, that's what I'm saying. I'm saying spider is a joke against a dancer. I genuinely think that dancer is the hard counter to spider. And I also think that uh, I'm going to take down these stupid spider webs because I don't know what's going to happen later in the game and I don't want to deal with them later on. Now, this is something that's very typical. It's very hard for me to get YouTube footage because there's a lot of hunters that just give up on me. And, you know, they go after me a little bit. They test the water and then they're just like, I'm not doing this anymore. And if they come after me as a dancer, I'm going to make them pay the consequence. So really, this is me going in for the rescue. I don't do anything spectacular. I wait for him. I'm trying to bait him. He doesn't come. I'll get closer to the window, uh, closer to the rocket chair. I'll put this down. I know that the last Cypher Machine is done because somebody put Cypher Machine primed. So I'm going to wait for him to take down that box. We're going to go for the rescue. We got Tide Turner. He ends up hitting him, but we got, there we go. Look at that. That is beautiful. Now against a Ripper, it's a lot more complicated with the rescues. And I just wanted to show footage of all four of us escaping in legendary rank mode. And as always, I'm going to hide the hunter's name. Thank you for watching my destroying hunter footage. Remember, y'all beautiful. Y'all are significant in this world. And let's change it. Take care now.